Stargazers around the world are getting ready for a very rare astronomical event today. The longest total lunar eclipse of the century is arriving this afternoon, and it's set to showcase a blood moon for most of the Eastern Hemisphere. Senior science and technology writer Nicole Mortolero is here with more to talk about this. So can you walk us through what to expect here with this lunar eclipse? All right, so um, this is the longest lunar eclipse in 100 years, uh, which is pretty significant. It's neat. Unfortunately, we're not going to see it. But there are, you know, there are ways to, to see it. Um, so it's going to extend from South America all the way across to New Zealand. But the best place to see it will be in Africa and Europe and parts of Asia. Um, and that takes place at 3.30, like totality, I should say. It will be 3.30 p.m. ET here okay. um, and that's when the moon um, goes through Earth's shadow uh, and there are two shadows we actually have a penumbra which is the lighter outer shadow and the umbra which is the darker shadow and that's when that's how we get an eclipse so the moon passes through that dark shadow and we actually can see that effect on the moon why is it called a blood moon you know, lately, I think through social media, everybody loves these phrases. Yeah. Um, so the blood moon actually refers to the redness of the moon. Mm -hmm. So it can turn, it depends on what the particles are in the air. So what happens is the sun is directly behind Earth and it, it refracts that light, it bends it, and the red light is the only uh, color on the spectrum that makes it to the moon, which reflects back. Uh, to Earth, and it's interesting. If you were standing on the Moon, you would see the Earth completely blacked out, and then this ring of red around it as through the atmosphere as all the sun rises and all the sunsets are occurring at once. Oh yeah, can yeah. you imagine? It must be better yeah. from that point yeah, of view. Yeah, exactly. Then. <laughs> and as you said, so Canadians can't see it from here. But is there another way that we can witness yeah, this? Yeah, there are online uh, sites, um, and two of the ones that are pretty popular are the Virtual Telescope Project and also SLOW, S-L-O-O-H, if you're looking for that. And they're going to show the entire eclipse. And I should say that, you know, Newfoundland kind of is sort of going to get it, but it's going to be the penumbra, which you can't really see. So. Okay. Well, when can Canadians see a lunar eclipse? When's the next one over here? Yes, the next one. Unfortunately, we had years, uh, a year and a half, where we had all these great eclipses, and now we're kind of in a dry spell. We had one at the beginning of the year. Next one, January 21st, 2019, and we will be able to see it all. Okay. And w what else is happening in the skies? Like, if we were to look up tonight, w what are we going to see? There's a lot happening, actually. Yes. It's always. amazing, you know? Um, <laughs> this is a good month, and of course, it's all about Mars. Um, so right now, uh, today, Mars is at opposition. So that's when um, Earth directly lies ben between Mars and the Sun. But then, as you'll see here, this is how it's, it's, uh, it's, has, it's been moving uh, over the past year. So, and then on Tuesday, you'll be able to see it when it is going to be 57 uh, million kilometers from uh, Earth, which is the closest it's been in, since 2003. But tonight, as well, when you go out, you can see Mars and the Moon together, paired together about five degrees apart. And that's about the width of your three fingers. Uh, this is not, the, you know, the Hunger Games salute or anything. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, three fingers apart and uh, at arm's length. And that is amazing. But also, don't forget, you're going to see Saturn and uh, Jupiter in the south. Saturn will be in the south. Jupiter will be in the southwest. And, of course, Venus is bright right after sunset, and it's amazing. Yeah, you're selling me on all of this, Nicole. Yes. Thanks Let's go so on. much. Now i got plans tonight. <laughs> Thank you. No <laughs> Nicole Martellera joining us here in studio.